Welcome back to House of Romans. My name is Manuel. So uh, today I'm gonna talk talk to you guys about a, a certain house. And I was here like, okay, I've talked about a couple of houses before, but I don't think I've spoken about this one. It's from the House of Lacoste. So I got seven fragrances from that house that, that to me personally, I like these. Uh, to me, they're very, very nice fragrance. So here we go. Oh, I'm gonna give you Never gonna let you go, never gonna say goodbye, no Never gonna give you up I'm never gonna let you go, never gonna say goodbye, no Never gonna give, never gonna give, never gonna give you up Never gonna give, never gonna give Never gonna give, never gonna give, never gonna give you up Never gonna give, never gonna give Thank you for sticking around. So again, today I'm gonna talk about a certain house that I enjoy, that I love, that I was looking in my collection. Like, man, you know what? I got, I got a couple of them from that house. And I'm talking from the house of Lacoste. Lacoste. <laughs> I like saying that name. Anyways, so they're in, they're not in any particular order. These are very, very nice. Uh, a lot of these are summer fragrances that uh, I could have put those in the videos from yesterday. But again, these are very, very nice. Again, they're not in any particular order. Uh, I'm gonna start off with the first one that's got a lot of hype. A lot of people talked about it and their summer fragrances this year. I mean, this past summer and the year before that. And and I think uh, a lot of people still th talk about it. And I think we'll continue talking about this one. It's a Lacoste White Blanc Perlou. Perlou. <laughs> again, this is a very nice uh, summer fragrance. And these, I bought these as testers. I got like two or three different testers. And a lot about the testers, they don't come with the cap. And luckily, they're a drug important where I purchased these at. They come with a little gray cap at least. So I can take them with me, lock them up, and, you know, take them with me if I'm going out of town or whatever it might be. But this was a nice, fresh, citrusy, nice, beautiful, uh, I guess when you, when, when you smell it, with the freshness of it, and it's messing me up a little bit because I was making a little, I was making some chicken <laughs> a while ago. But again, again, when, when you smell this, this is a nice fresh scent. Where basically when you when you smell this, it smells like it could be you could be wearing like a white tee, according you know by the color of the bottle. But again, this is a very casual type of scent that you would wear, uh, that you would wear in a casual type of environment or. Uh, even for for an office fragrance, this is very very nice. Again, Lacoste uh, Blanc Perlou. The next one, the next one again. These next these first four are gonna be from the house of uh, Lacoste. Was it twelve twelve line? This one is called uh, Perlou Magnetic Magnetic. This is a little bit more, it, it tends to hit like a sort of like a sweetness of it, but like it, it, it tries to hit to the sweetness, but it can't read, it can't hit it yet. But again, it's a nice, again, another fresh, kind of powdery, but not in a bad way. Cause you know, you, you know, you guys, you guys know that I'm not a big powdery type of uh, guy, the fragrance type of guy. But this is just enough where it just, it, it just, it tries to get there with the sweetness, but it don't, but it's very, very pleasant. Very, very nice. Very uh, mass appealing. So you're not going to, I don't see people complain about it if you used to wear this in an office environment or even out and about. And again, the uh, Lacoste Porlu Manatique. Probably chopping up the name real bad. The next one, the next one, uh, it's the red one called Rogue from La Lacoste 1212 Rogue. And these have pretty, I should show you guys, pretty decent uh, atomizers. Ah, uh, this is a little bit nicer, a little bit more elegant. Again, the other ones are more like a casual. This one, just off the bat, you can smell it. It seems you, can, you have to be a little bit more dressed up. 
a little bit more vibrant, a little bit more life in this one. Now, the other ones, again, they're nice, but this one has a little bit more character, a little more, uh, sort of like a party type of uh, uh, fragrance. Not a sweet, but like a little bit more live fragrant. Very, very nice. Again, just as a, it hits the sweetness of it. I remember, I think it had like a mango or, I think it was like a mango uh, note in it. But again, just a little bit more live, a little bit uh, more wild, uh, a little bit more out there than the other ones. Again, Lacoste 212 uh, Rogue. The next one, the next one, it was seven total, guys. I forgot to tell you that in the beginning. The next one is seven total of Lacoste that I have. Uh, the next one is uh, the one in the green bottle. Lacoste 1212 Old Fresh. This one, and it took me a while to get this one. And the reason I wanted to get it, cause uh, I had heard, saw uh, Trey from Trey since, check his channel out. He really said this was a very nice, fresh, bright, citrusy. Man, get it all over my lips. I guess this is exactly what it is. It's, a, it's like with a hint of greenness, probably like, man, man just a hint of greenness, greenness with some citrus in it, a little bit more louder than the other ones. The freshness in it is more brighter than the other than the other three. Very, very nice. The citrus, very, very uh, out there. Again, Lacoste Au Fresh. You can see the name on it. Two more, two more. A lot of these are very nice freshies. And this one I have bought it. I just now remembered. This one I bought it, uh, I think this one I paid like 20 bucks. And I don't know if you can be able to tell. They scratched it off to see what was the lever on. It's almost full, so I thought it was a good, good deal. That's why I jumped on this one. The next one. The next one is from uh, is, uh, Lacoste Per Own. I believe this is the one that had the... the, the the scent profile of Plum, if I remember correctly. Yeah. This one, ooh, I love this one. Oh man, this is very sweet. This is a sweet fragrance, sweeter than the rest of them. Hint, again, another hint of powdery in it, but very, very just, like they say, like I, I've always said, like just a little dust of powdery note. And that's what I like. I just like, I like the powdery note, but just a little dust. Just where you can barely pick on it. But the sweetness, it just, it like that powdery note gives that, that uh, sweetness, uh, picks it up. It, it raises up that, that sweetness level. And it makes, it rounds off that sweetness level. Very, very nice. I like this, especially, you know, being a sweet fragrance. Another one that I could reach for. This, this one, this is more to me, again, it's my opinion. To me, this is more like a date night type of fragrance a sweet fragrance again it's just something you can, you can use when you're going out during the night more close encounter uh spray around your neck your girl get close to you you're gonna see gonna like it again lacoste perone I, I i can see a girl liking it the next one the next one i the next one when i was looking for for perone and, and, and I was there at Ross with my sister, so I was really looking for the Peron before I grabbed the one I'm talking about next, which is Lacoste Leon. And uh, so I saw it was a 200, I think it's a 200 mil bottle. Oh, 150, 150 mil bottle. So I'm like, man, you know what? Heck yeah. So I purchased, I was talking to my sister, so and I couldn't remember what the box looked like. And, but this one's in a gray box, and I think this one's in a silver box, I remember if I remember correctly. Silver and gold box, I can't remember, but I know this one's in a gray box. So I was looking for this one, to purchase this one, and don't regret it. This is a nice, nice fragrance. This is Lacoste Leon. This is very nice, y'all. Again, I just wish I could just go. You smell it? You smell it? <laughs> this is a nice, citrusy, 
sweet. It's like a fruity. It's like a fruity, nice, well-rounded. This is good, good, good for during the daytime. A good office scent. The only thing that I have on this one, the only thing, it probably lasts on me probably about four hours, four and a half hours. But again, I do not mind. I've taken, a, I put some in the in the can, burned down quite a little bit when I first purchased it. And I like this a lot. This is a very, very nice. Again, I recommend this one to also you can use this on a date night. Very, very beautiful scent. But again, some people say it lasts them a long time. I wish it would last on me a long time, but because I really enjoy this one. But again, I do not mind taking a decan. So again, Lacoste Leon. The next one, the next one has a little bit more better performance on me. Excuse me. It's uh, from, again, Lacoste Leon Intense. I've been looking for, for a bigger bottle of this one and hopefully I can find one in the near, in the near future. This one's a little bit. Oh man, this is, this is nice. It's a little bit more sweet, a little bit more intense than the Leon. This is very, very nice. This one do last on me about five hours, five, five and a half to six hours. Very, very beautiful scent. You can't go wrong with either one of these two. Again, this is a little bit more, like I said, it's more intense, more out there, more brighter, more, more in your face, the sweetness, the, 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 the freshness. Very, very, very nice. I like this a lot. Again, Leon, Lacoste Leon Intense. Again, just giving, giving you guys a quick video um, on fragrances. I don't think I've really seen anybody talk about any of these other ones. Maybe once or twice, but this one again, the the, the white one is always the, gets to be brought up even more, more in during the summer fragrances than any of the other ones. But again, all these other ones pretty nice. Uh, these right here, the only thing is performance wise, but again, I do not mind taking the decan. I don't mind taking the bottle itself. Like today, I have my fragrance of the day was uh, Abbey Crummy and Finch uh, together, I, small bottle. I took it with me to work, you know, reapply myself and uh, put it in your pocket when you go in the restroom. That's what I do, go in the restroom, put it in my pocket, you know, do what I gotta do, come out, spray myself before I hit the office, and you straight. Again, have you tried any of these? Have you got your nose on any of these Lacoste fragrance? What is your opinion on Lacoste? Again, some people like it, some people don't. Me personally, I enjoy it. I really like this, this house. I really enjoy the fragrance that, that they offer. And again, uh, leave a comment down below. Uh, give me a thumbs up. If you think it's a good video, any suggestions of any topics. Again, like, share, and subscribe. And uh, see you guys in the next video. Make sure you hit the bell icon to let you, to let you know when you're up upload new videos. Again, like, share, and subscribe, and see you guys on the next video.